Last night's headliners, the Obamas, did what they do best, giving explosive speeches in support of Kamala Harris. Hello, Chicago! Former President Barack Obama electrifying the crowd in his hometown as he closed out day two of the DNC. He acknowledged the momentum behind the Harris Walls ticket, but said it doesn't mean they're in the clear just yet. This will still be a tight race in a closely divided country. From the DNC to Kamala Harris's campaign rally in Milwaukee, the night was light on policy and heavy on Trump bashing, with some of the hardest hits coming from former First Lady Michelle Obama. For years, Donald Trump did everything in his power to try to make people fear us. Who's going to tell him that the job he's currently seeking might just be one of those black jobs? Trump, meanwhile, is counterprogramming the DNC with events all week. Tuesday, he was in Michigan talking crime and safety. Look at radical liberal Kamala Harris. She's been the ringleader for this anti-crime and the anti-police crusade. Back in Chicago, the theme for day three of the convention is a fight for our freedoms. Democrats will hit on reproductive rights and the efforts they say Republicans will take to further impact them. They will come for IVF next. And special focus remains on security around the DNC as protests against the Israel-Hamas war continue near the United Center. Tonight, Governor Tim Walls makes his DNC debut to give his vice presidential nominee speech. In Chicago, Rebecca Castor, Fox News.